Hello everyone, this is the takeoff procedures for the Mirage 3V, the vertical variant, vertical takeoff and landing variant of the Mirage 3E. Given the unforgiving flight model of this aircraft, this video is necessary to avoid confusion and the speeches such as I can't fly the plane or the plane is unflyable. Uh, following along those lines, I will also explain problems and difficulties regarding the creation of this model and why it behaves the way it does. Now, the first step is go on configurations, controls, aircraft, full rear control, then search for brakes. After you see left brake and right brake, go on edit axis, set both values for increase value and decrease value, preferably closer to each other. Mimic everything around here, so this, it resembles as much as possible to these, and make sure to have relative control on, so it behaves like a throttle. Instead of just needing to press it to keep 100%, it keeps the last value in input, like if I press all the way to 80%, it will keep 80%. Now, after that is done, press OK. Then, make sure to go back to mouse aim, make sure to go back, mouse aim, close, then resume. There are two ways to take off from the Mirage 3V, all the variants that I've implemented, but the way that I'm going to show you right now, since I'm landed on the crown start deck, is, first of all, Make sure to have your brakes, I'm pressing the button, make sure to have uh, your brakes to 100%, as you can see over here. Then, deploy your wings, really cool, right? They go all the way to raised. After they are attached in place, let me see if I can show... You can see those two cylinders on the front, there are also two of them on the back, and little square rect rectangles on the tip of the wings. Those are attitude controls, just showing how the model would control itself in real life. Now, after you have your brakes to 100%, your throttle on zero, and your VTOL nozzles to 100%, with the middle mouse button, slowly increase, slowly, make sure you're doing it slowly, slowly increase the throttle all the way to 100%, to allow the engines, the eight engines on the middle, to fully spool up. Now, as you reach 100%, make sure to go on web and you'll be taken off. After taking off, retrieve your landing gear and your air brake. Make sure to not turn on hover mode, otherwise your model will behave as so unstable. Hover mode absolutely destroys the controls of the whole plane. Now, after that is done, you can see this is the Exocet missile. Uh, I won't talk about it now. But after you switch to, as you gain enough speed, let me show. Yeah, after you gain enough speed and you disable your throttles, the inlets will close and the afterburner will turn on. Now, to land the Mirage 3V as any other aircraft in War Thunder, like any VTOL aircraft, is the same thing. You, first of all, disable web, put the vector controls at 100%, press your air brake button, which on my case is unfortunately bound to the hover mode, brake, start braking uh, uh, by turning the aircraft, one of the two. Let me see if I can get rid of these. Yeah, I can. I'm now light and come on come on yes now that you saw after the VTOL controls turned on the aircraft itself pitched way harder because it recognized and start launching air through those attitude controls uh, I cannot turn the afterburner on anymore it means I'm fully VTOL mode now uh, I'm closer to the Acroyo, I'm gonna land there. And the reason why I say, I'm gonna say again, or if I didn't say, I'm saying right now, the reason why the landing is better is because the engines are already spooled and at high temperatures.
and high RPMs. So you don't need to care as much. So now that we are, oh, don't do that, don't do that. Last thing, be sure to not bank, roll and pitch way too hard in veto mode or like the hover mode incident, you also lose control. Now, getting close to the Arc Royal, you can break like I'm doing right now, pointing away from the direction of flight. Um, I got way heavier because of the exosets. 100%. Gear out. I'm gonna keep the the wings folded in to get more immersed, but you don't have to. Unfortunately, like let me show you. In game, the attitude controls on the wings oh, are not modeled, so there's no real difference on if you have the wings folded or not. I would have uh, implemented that if I know how to code, which is the reason why I cannot make this model less unforgiving. Oh, that's the main reason why. So let's land. Poof. Very nice. Cafe, do, 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 do. Brakes, make sure to brake. And after you're, you're, you're finally, how can I say, landed? That's it. That's everything you have to say. The model will be for sale on my art station. And that's it. Thank you for watching. And good flying.